Ni azibuda. Unaweza dance kidogo? Hey. Sasa tengesha mabega. Kitu yangu mimi niko na miguu mbili za leo. Mabega na stickers zinaweza song. Karim sana fine. Asante sana bro. See, bro. Thanks man. Bila minute. I know, I know. Mm, the yang... last time tulira ilikuwa 2 years ago. Ilikuwa 2 years. Umefinya chuma. Siko nimefinya chuma hiyo. Eh wala. Ah nilikuwa na ficha white. So pia mimi kuna hope. Uh, kuna hope bro. Na Tibo ina <laughs> Tibo. Yo yo ti hapo before boy itabidi apunguze. <laughs> Ama ti yake ni ya gold. Ti yake ni ya gold bala. Sawa. Naona. Yes. I good to see you bro. Ah, thanks Mekuwa man. Mimi nimekuwa fit sana. Karibu nianze kwa click click bang. Eh eh. Like kumbuka taidi. <laughs> <laughs> Lazima tuanzie home. Tuko Lazima home. tuanzie home. Yes. Hapa ndio ulianzia. Hapa ndio nilianzia. Yes I. Uh, interesting story. Nimeingia kwa studio. This is the first time niko hapa mbele ya cameras, but I used to direct. Uh, I think back in 2009 I used to direct this show. Hapa ndio nilianzia. Hii show hii. Hii show hapa hii yeah. show for real. Yeah. And then uh but tahidi hai uh, nilingia tahidi hai in 2007 yes yes so this is home citizen is always home citizen is always home absolutely wamekupea chai huko oh, wamenipatia chai eh <laughs> hey. nimeingia kwa gate hata sijaulizo maswali ni ah 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 huyu ni yule wa tahidi huyu amerudi home amerudi home kabisa karibu sana nyumbani shukran sana kabisa mm-hmm. experience yako ya tahidi ilikuwaaje ah We just sit king at Ahidi for us it, it was something we were doing for fun we mm-hmm. we are actors we loved performing we tulisikia kuna audition we audition we got in tukaingia tukapiga show tukaua the one thing i was not prepared for we were not prepared for was the fame the fame hiyo nayo ilitutandika hiyo ilitupata off guard unapanda matatu hivi we wanashanga huyu actually the main reason nilinunua my first car ilikuwa je hiyo kuna kuna wakati nilingia kwa basi vile tu nimeingia hivi kuna madhali ni notice so akashout aka, aka akaanza story mm-hmm. and <coughs> between place nilipandia dita the entire bus was discussing me nikasi ni kwa hapo but wanda ni discuss wanda discuss show ah nilishuka tu hivi nikasema haki natafuta pesa ya gari <laughs> tag it tena tag it tena yes i yeah the wazazi wako walikuwa supportive for, for the talent absolutely absolutely um unajua hiyo time i was still in college when i got the role so for mother ilikuwa fanya fanya hiyo kabla upate kazi kabla upate kazi uh-huh. because back then uh, for a lot of parents they didn't see it as a career for them ilikuwa mchezo so yeah. wewe ndo cheze cheze hata ukipata na mtu alikuwa anakuuliza naweza ingia hiyo mchezo yenyewe eh, eh, yeah. hadi wale unapata na ngana mzazi anakuambia kuna kijana yangu amemaliza high school so uh-huh. unaweza mchukua mcheze cheze na yeye hapa <laughs> before before <laughs> before ajue kile atafanya before ajue kile atafanya but um, with time and for the longest time bado alikuwa ananiambia surudi shule upate degree utafute kazi mm-hmm. but with time alikam ko appreciate na kuona it's actually a whole industry mm-hmm. and right now she's my biggest fan yeah. my number one supporter acha kwambia sasa utafute kazi Aha. anajua hii ni kazi acha ajue hii ni kazi <laughs> all right yes. mlikuwa mbogi kubwa sana tahidi haya yeah. hata nikurudisha nyuma kidogo right. kuna wale wali punch kuna wale life ili watuonga kidogo yeah. kuna wale family wa kula mm-hmm. na kuna wale pia bado wana struggle right. na sasa kuna nyinyi master <laughs> Stike wataja nyinyi wote <laughs> lakini nataka unipeleke na hiyo step ni uri, like uh, there are there guys out there maybe ndio wameanza kuupunch yeah wanaona fame imeanza kuwaingia mm-hmm. ama unapata labda ile do wanapata juu acting pia iko na do yeah. and then unajua unajua ga itakuja tu ingine yeah, what's your advice to them um i think the one thing that uh, saved me and let's say abel just you work pamoja sana yeah um for us we always had a bigger vision a bigger dream mm-hmm. so at atukingia tahidi hai at that point yes we started off as actors but we already knew tutafungua production company and we wanted to tell our own stories and our own films so for me hiyo fame hata vile ilikuja na hiyo dove ile ilianza kuingia it, it didn't get to my head juu sikuwa nimefika yeah. hata saipa alini kwa sijafika mm-hmm. yes we, we are doing the films tunaanza kupata hiyo recognition but my goal is so much bigger so wasituli na kuna time na feel ni kan mefika so unaweza relax mm-hmm. so for the actor that's coming up for the entertainer that's coming up i think just have a bigger vision a bigger goal because it's very easy for the fame and the money to get into your head and then you say my fame ni side effect ya job poor yeah you're famous uh, tibo ya pay is famous but you're famous because of the work you do yeah true. na ni job fit yeah. so the minute unaanza ku lean into the fame 
unasahau kazi yako oh. buda hivyo ndio tutakusahau ka dj yep. uh, yeah. well, yeah. na kitu sio kudanganya wasi wanakupenda because of the work you do yes. the minute utacha kudu hiyo job wanakusahau tunakusahau na tunasonga uh-huh. yeah tidy i may come imeisha mm-hmm. yeah sasa hapo sasa ndio kimeanza kuramba watu sasa <laughs> si ndio yes. wewe uko umejiposition aje design even after tidy high because sasa mngesoma say copy yeah. forever <laughs> unajua unaona kumbuka mimi nakumbuka nilikuwa nakimbiaga home haraka sana niende nione kina umosh kina OJ yani tidy high ilikuwa got the in thing yes. back in the days yes. sasa imekam imekatika mm-hmm. uli create your bridge aje ya ku make sure that unakuwa relevant even after Uh, Blen make sure uh, acting for me was a means to an end so i always knew i wanted to, to be a director and a producer so hata vile tuliingia tahidi i think i was only an actor for one year just as an actor but nikiwa hapo nilikuwa nashinda nikisimba producer eh ni aje mimi nimesomea kitu inaitwa cinema si unipe job hapa hivi ka crew and luckily i got that break so i started off as a production assistant and i grew slowly slowly to an assistant director by that so by the time hata natoka Tahidi I was already directing full shows full episodes and then Bado akani co-opt the producer akani peleka mother in law so at some point I was directing both mother in law and Tahidi high mm-hmm. so for me even when the acting stopped I still continued directing the show for a couple of years after tumetoka because I think our class to graduate in 2011 but i left uh, tahidi and sit and mother in law in 2014 mm-hmm. i was still directing right mm-hmm. unajua wewe ni ile package niambia go ni kama inaita go one in all ama all in one all in one all in one unaweza kuwa unaweza kuwa actor yes unaweza produce direct yes, yes. na unaweza when you feel make a bad so waga una e switch waga una una control aje ah ama mbona usi lean on sasa mimi ni film make <laughs> hey, bro Uh, in the world we are living in sayo unaweza tegemea kitu moja bro yes. ni ngumu sana hata sisi tuko hapa huyu ametoka usiku sasa ni mtu ametoka pala usiku Milan you can put yourself in one box you have to try everything kutoka hapa maybe kuna pick up imejaa viazi hapa napeleka kitumba huko so uh number one i think it's a survival skill set that you need right now in the world that we are living in always it again yak tomorrow yeah, you know, need kwa na multi multi sources of income uh, sources of income and skills so yes. for me it's the advantage is all these things i can do are in one industry so it's not like something totally new i'm learning so you you need patian edge mm-hmm. yeah ni character gani ama ni nini yenye ulifanya ikakutoka kwa comfort zone yako ah There's a there's a short film uh, it's not very well known but it it won uh, a Kalasha award I think in 2017 mm-hmm. uh, where I was an actor and in the role I was playing an abusive uh, partner mm-hmm. and there was a lot of sexual violence so uh, there were <laughs> sex scenes mm-hmm. so that was hard <laughs> so that really got me out of the comfort zone yeah yeah all right na bado unasukuma bado tunasukuma unasikia kama utawacha ah ndo nimeanza ndo nimeanza haraka haraka sasa tutoke sasa hizo ni ma TBT kabisa tuingie sasa mahali sasa yeah feel Mhm. Ameanza ku feel it. Yes. Yes, I. Yeah. Feel. Ameanza ku. Word play, word play, bro. Na kuona bro ingia. Click click bang. Yeah. Mkakuja mkachukua award. Ilikuwa ni award gani? Ah, uh, click click bang won uh, two awards, uh, best East African film and best indigenous film at the Africa Viewers Magic Choice Awards. I think I hope sija kosea which is like the Oscars of Africa. So yeah. that is a big deal. I think we're the first ones in Kenya to win that award yeah ah it's not on your pesa ikaingia that is on your pesa ikaingia believe it or not yeah. um, right from na, na, sijimbo na i'm sure unapata ngai kitu sana mtaani ukionekana kwa tv in this country hey. for some reason hey. watu uju uko na do bye okay ziko <laughs> what see <is> then you <laughs> so what i tell people ni yeah. um the acting the fame doesn't give you the money but he, the fact that isura yangu ni more uh, 
inajulikana zaidi it's easier for a lot of doors to open for me so mm -hmm. the money does not come from the products that we create do you talk an ile opportunity neza neza get juice hizo milango zinafunguka mm -hmm. yes so acha right. tuseme yeah, pesa inakuja <laughs> pesa inakuja <laughs> sio direct <laughs> yes sir yeah becoming ceo mm -hmm. are you the producer are you the or the owner <laughs> are you the executive producer what are you in becoming the ceo and what is becoming ceo okay Uh, Becoming CEO is a podcast on YouTube mm -hmm. and where we have conversations with successful men and women and mm -hmm. what furnish their journey the route they took to success uh, now the main reason I do becoming CEO is number one, um we live an, in an age where you need to market yourself you need to be constantly on social media now personally I don't think I'm very interesting for social media so I, I needed to know how I can exist in a space on social media so that I can continue pushing my businesses and everything that I do. Mm -hmm. So becoming CEO is what I do on a daily life. Uh -huh. Becoming CEO started because I started off as an artist then now I own a company and I've been given the title CEO. Mm -hmm. I had no idea what it means to run a company. So what I used to do is have conversations with men and women who run different organizations and businesses so that I can learn from them. And so when the need for me to be active on social media came up, then I was like, you know what, these conversations that I have behind closed doors, let me put a camera in front. So whatever I do on becoming CEO is what I do on a daily. I am always learning from successful men and women. All right. Yeah. Hi. Bro. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is the next CEO. Oh yes, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Playmaker entertainer. There you go. There you go. There you go, man. I'm also CEO. Mm. Abisa, bro. Ben Suda, you know, avocados and <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about Clickling Bang. Mm -hmm. Netflix. Yes. Bro. Uh-huh. Na make boss moves in town bus. Um man tunashukuru first of all ni god we, we we don't take credit for everything uh ni god um but click click bang being on netflix for us is a testament that um stick to your guts do your story because for the longest time to make what kids try to pitch to netflix and we were not getting our shows there mm -hmm. because they didn't understand this type of stories you guys are doing Unajua. but right now it did so well it, it's performed so well on Netflix mm -hmm. so now there are conversations they're about to start having with us mm -hmm. now for us we've remained true to telling the actual story click click bang you take in sheng you take on tani ko ghetto so tunaambia na story za ukweli za ground and we don't need to it does not need to look like a movie from hollywood for it to be on Netflix mm -hmm. we stick to our stories let them come to us and that is what is happening and that's important for the industry and for all the filmmakers mm -hmm. do your own indigenous stories our takuja atakuja yeah all right there's uh, maybe a filmmaker out there mwanashanga mimi niko na kipindi nimetafuta Netflix kwa party process iko namna gani is it so hard to make sure that uh, or to to get a platform on Netflix ama what's the process like uh, right now it's not as hard because they are actively looking for content um, but the way it works is Netflix cannot deal with you as an individual or as a filmmaker so kuna content aggregators or agents that are uh, commissioned by Netflix to look for 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 films so none of them is housed in Kenya unfortunately yeah. uh utapata most of them their headquarters are in Netherlands or Dubai or Nigeria but they have they they what they've done is they've gotten Kenyans to work in those agencies <coughs> so now uh, now there i think about three or four agencies that you can find in Kenya mm -hmm. that you can pitch to them and then in turn they pitch to Netflix uh -huh. yeah it's, you know tibo uh -huh. eh i'm a big consumer of um, feels uh, content work and content that's why ngine mimi shanga Ufikaki mali unasikia kama sasa kichwa umekuwa overwhelmed like sasa creativity imeanza kuisha sasa like abana unaandika script hivi unafika mali unasema wacha nilale ama wacha sasa nifunge hii kazi what do you do kamali na kwama eh una yani akili ime what do you do like to make sure that your mind is active creatively like you have to make sure that kuna content ume produce mali kuna hapa kuna 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 acting bado unafaa kufanya pale kuna mse bado pale anategemea mpatie script. Because you also believe you're a script writer, right? Yeah, sure. Yes. Yeah, 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 there you go. Um 
one of the lessons I learned from becoming CEO by being a CEO is delegating and uh, it's it's just a natural process of things it afka two point how na energy kufanya kila kitu and also you need to groom others so with time uh, a lot of the works like directing producing with time to nimeenda kuna wase nime groom and now they can run right now i'm here but there's a show being shot i don't need to be there yeah. you know a delegate so, to not delegate yes. it's part of the process yeah. as i also learn now how to be more of an executive officer and learn how to grow the business so say hiyo ndio journey ni iko yeah so uh, but at the same time as in the chain <laughs> the chain <laughs> but at the same time lazima uji keep grounded uh ndo sisa how like i said why people love you in the first place they love you for the work so for the films and the tv shows that i do mm-hmm. so what i do is i won't do all the shows now mm-hmm. but i'll choose a specific show where every year i have to direct at least one season of a tv show and i have to direct at least one film okay. and then the rest of the months in the year now i'm doing ceo stuff all right yeah chi boy oh. any question bro <laughs> yeah, i mean he's he's broken down everything to be like i said you know at, at the end of the day is all about growth yeah true the growth is important from where he started to not be being able to run his own company and be able to nurture other people you see for him like him being now he being here now yeah. and, and like he said the other people kazi bado inaendelea it means is uh i mean i create job opportunities you know his mentoring mentorship and all that stuff so yeah. Where can people find you if maybe let's say they want to get in touch with you and things like that? Okay. Uh social media mm-hmm. look for at Phil Director mm-hmm. across all uh no Phil Director on Instagram, Philip Karanza on Facebook, on Twitter it's Phil Director Pia with the, with a double L mm-hmm. and on YouTube my biggest channel um Phil Director on YouTube there's a show called Becoming CEO. Subscribe Someone you could DM Ati? you reply. Manze I try I I won't lie hapo uja delegate hapo uja delegate PA wa kujibu DMs actually to be delegate we siezi keep up and the majority of um, the DMs that ukuja nza wasi wanatafuta job unfortunately hiyo ni 80% alafu sasa kuna 20 eh sasa imegawana gawa imegawana gawa hizo hizo ujisumbui dad um so for those who always DM and and I can't trip especially work after job uh, that thing hurts me because manzi yeah. <laughs> I am one person I always it and I take everyone on everyone board. else but it is what it is so we continue engaging and thank you for anyone who reaches out to me yeah. I appreciate it I love you back all right some content view to let up of you sasa eh tunalipa gapoa sana but yeah. itabidi so ukiona zimekuwa mingi saa nyingine unatusukumia hivi aina noma pia pia si tunasukuma usio watu wengi uni, uniuliza feel uko na VOD platform yenu feel TV then mmepeleka content netflix bado mna work na showmax yeah. and uko oh. the truth is um kuna hii mentality wa Kenya wamekuwa nayo it's always like you're competing yeah. no, no 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 let me tell you the truth if visasa has a million subscribers showmax has 2 million netflix has 3 million feel tv has 5 million hey. <laughs> <laughs> at the end of the day it means there's more work and more money in the industry so it is my priority my number one priority to grow the kenyan audience and that's where we are at so i am not competing with viewsasa my goal is i'd want viewsasa to hit 5 million subscribers because the more subscribers viewsasa has the more they inject into the industry the more work i have true dad yes all right talk to the youths kuna my youth pale mtaani anasema kama mimi ni kwa mkubwa nataka kafuel process jani talk to them um akuna shortcut unfortunately you have to put in the work um yeah there's no shortcut and the more the more you learn the more you earn so consistently always seek for for knowledge yeah. the more you learn the more you earn right. akuna shortcut Thank you so much for passing by Thank for you. swinging by Thank you. like in your mwisho kabla uende yes, you lead a very private life right is it your tactic or your way of life <laughs> so just feel 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 him come he's there but he's, he's not, not there. there he's yeah. there you see the content but he he has a way of keeping his private life private yeah, yeah. Uh, how do you find that balance Number one, I'm a very boring guy. <laughs> I don't think there's much to show. Uh and two uh 
genuinely, uh, we, we got into Tahidi High when I was still in college. Mm -hmm. So I've literally grown up in the public light. Mm -hmm. Literally, my entire life. So all my mistakes, all my faults, everything in the public light. So once in a while, unataka ujibakishie kidogo. Kidogo tu. Yeah, but I, other than that, I think I'm just a very boring guy. <laughs> life young saint. Ni, ni boring, eh? Ni boring. So hobbies ako sila include ni? Yes, so no one. Who and because Chris? Mintamka, ninge jima subui, ninge job. Ni fikia kijani jioni. Wanze scripting. Ni wanze scripting ama nchukue novel, ni some ama ni watch movie. Yeah, yeah, You'll never find yeah, me in a club yeah, yeah. or anywhere. Yeah. 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 Boring life. Yeah, ni boring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but thank you so much for swinging by. We do appreciate, man. Thanks, Thanks. for your time. Thanks a lot, bro. You're always welcome. Thank you. Hapa ndiyo nyumbani. Hapa ndiyo nyumbani. Kabisa. Ah, na shukuru. It's your design. That was ah. feel it. <laughs> eh. Yeah. Becoming CEO. Kabisa. We are, we are, we are our own CEOs. Absolutely, it. absolutely. It's your design. DJ Roy T-Boy, what you got, brother?